if you open any sub tab <clears throat> so this is the view in sui and it will open uh, a uh, the view all record section here so that's the only difference so same thing applies for even other objects as well So now we will see the comparison between or uh, the importance of application composer tool and uh, visual builder. <clears throat> application composer, we still uh, you we will use to define the data model. Okay, so to use or uh, to extend the classic UI that is uh, the existing ADF pages, etc. So those will be still still will be there and to define some logic like server scripts all those validations etc to define any custom sub custom security custom object security for reporting like uh custom subject areas uh creation all those things so all those will be there uh So we, we, we still use uh, to create objects, to create fields, to create uh, relationships, to modify the field properties. We still use application composer tool. There is no change in that, uh, defining the, uh, the data model. So then <clears throat> application composer, uh, so we use pages, right? Pages section and uh, actions, buttons, links for dynamic layouts. Okay. So sub tabs. So all these things, mashups, including mashups. So because whatever related to pages, so that will be replaced with Visual Builder Studio. So it's all, we are not going to use this pages and uh, actions and links uh from application composer so that will be replaced with visual builder studio because these are belong to ui so and visual builder is for ui layer so it will be replaced but still this will be there uh, so it will be there for some time i think Then all remaining groovy uh, object field validation, uh, then uh, any object workflows, BPM, web services, all those things, okay, uh, field properties. So those will be still available as, as usual. Security, okay, that will be available. So then what is, <clears throat> uh, then visual coming to visual builder, uh, so this Visual Builder Studio is the tool to extend uh, all the Fusion Cloud pages. So not only for sales or service, it is for entire uh, Fusion Cloud application. So for all Fusion Cloud applications, including HCM or SCM or so they will also have some extensions. So all the extensions will be uh, developed through this Visual Builder Studio. So Visual Builder Studio will have a project workspace, uh, then the designer where we will uh, use the uh, visual components to uh, add, get repository and administration of uh, the project. And, uh, and then build and deploy tools. So all those will be there in Visual Builder Studio. So to access, to, uh, access the Visual Builder Studio, um, so it, it, it is not provisioned to a production instance. So usually two instances will be provided, right? Uh, so that's the default. One is production and another one is test. So by default, Visual Builder Studio.
so now we will see the comparison between or uh, the importance of application composer tool and uh, visual builder <clears throat> application composer we still 